What's going on, Rare Hunters? Sword and Shield, Pokemon, Restocks, Walmart, Dollar General. Today I went out and picked up uh, Darkness uh, Blaze and Base Set Sword and Shield, as well as uh, from Dollar General, a single pack of Brilliant Stars. We're going to save that for last. But uh, the general idea is this. With these reprints and whatnot, are they better? Um... Does having reprints really mean you have the same access you have with the first release? I beg to differ. I think no. Sorry. With the first release uh, of a product, I usually have amazing pulls. So we're going to do this ETB first. But anyways, um, I usually have amazing pulls. But then as the reprints start coming out, those pulls become so much more harder. Now, again, this could just be a perception. I don't know. But uh, I'm going to open these up and show you what the pulls look like, okay? Now, I'm not going to go into, like, the contents of these ETBs because uh, these particular ET ETBs are so old that, you know, we know we get the sleeves. We know we get the, uh, uh, the dice and the, the card and everything else. Um... You know, you have to see the dice and you know unlike uh, celebrations there is no uh, real pull in that so here we have base set um now before i began this video i opened up with my son um a couple of base set uh sword and shield uh, packs ourselves and pulled this uh Snorlax v it's a good pull i like it we're going to set it over here off camera and uh, anyway, so yeah, it was kind of cool, you know. Um, we only opened a couple, so every video before I go to do a video, I always try to amp myself up by just grabbing some random packs, opening them up, and uh, getting that uh, the hype going. The the catch on that is if I'm not careful, I could pull some fire off camera, and well, nobody's gonna believe me <laughs> if I pull it. So with this, what we're looking at is. <laughs> Are the pull rates better um, because of this? You know, Danny Phantom did something like that, and uh, we're seeing for ourselves. You know, Pikachu, Zizzlepeed, Wooloo, Cottony, and a Galarian per circuit. Now, it's a hollow, but it's not an ultra rare. So, yeah. So, simply put, um, but he was doing it from the standpoint, I think he did. I don't know, he has a video, um, but uh, I previously on my own opened up uh, a a box of uh, an ETB of uh, Darkness of Blaze, and um, the hits were nowhere near there. So, energy, energy retrieval, heat more, drizzle, ghastly, Ponyard, Slizipede again, Yamper, Clubopus, Tort, Tortinator. Um, reverse hollow and then a Galarian Rapidash. I like that card. I'm gonna put that over there. That is a beautiful card. Alright, moving on. So, anyways, um, so yeah, I opened up a few days ago, I believe it was. Um over the weekend, I think, I don't remember. Um, I did open up some uh, uh an ETB. I also opened up a few other Pokemon products, and like I said, the pulls just between me and you. And all of us here at the, uh, the Rare Hunter Treasure Troves, we, um, I just have better luck with booster boxes than I do ETVs, with the exception of Celebrations. Celebrations, I, I happen to pull um, the uh, Golden uh, Shiny Mew and Charizard out of a single Pokemon Center Sableye. Um, I, I managed to pull uh, a Charizard Celebrations and a... Um, Golden Shiny Mew. So, this is not open at all. There it goes. I encourage it with my encouragement drill. Too drama. Still not open. I've always sat there and said if it's, if it's really hard to open, that means it's got something pretty epic. And I don't know what in uh, the base set is the good pulls. But, you know, there's your code card. We got one, two, three, four. Uh, so, you know, let me know in the comment section 
by the end of this year, we're going to be opening, uh, entering a new phase of uh, a new generation. Uh, Sword and Shield will be done with. Um, I don't particularly know what the new, uh, what's going to be new on that. But um, what do you think? You know, are you excited for future sets? Are you excited for uh, what's it called? Uh, Astral Radiance. You know, the new set that's coming out for. Sword and Shield, you know. I know I am. I ordered a case of that. Um, I think I also ordered a case of uh, ATVs too. So, uh, also uh, make sure you're subscribed. If you're not, uh, I strongly suggest you do because oh, drop not uh, not all over. Um, I got some pretty epic giveaways coming, and uh, as of this recording, um, I haven't posted the the, the giveaway yet. So or the what I'm talking about with this giveaway thing. So, um, but yeah, definitely want to make sure you're subscribed. Turn on the bell notifications because you're going to want to hear this announcement. Um, as the time of this recording, like I said, I don't, I haven't done the video for this announcement yet, but it is for this channel, pretty epic. I don't know uh, if other people have done it or are going to do it, but it's definitely something I want to do. We're going to rod bidet, cottony, choodle, right horn. Rookity, Krabby, Shootle, and a Rillaboom. But anyways, it's going to be epic. It's going to be legendary. Um, it's something I'm very excited to do. It's a way to give back to the community. And um, like all my giveaways, all you have to do is comment, like, be subscribed. So definitely subscribe so you have that chance to enter in. Um, I think I'm editing that video now. Um... As one for each side of what I do. Uh, so there's going to be a Team Yoker. I got that in Secret Earth. Um, one for Pokemon. There's a, a giveaway announcement for that. And, and DDV. Now that is a pretty card. Um, there's going to be one for the Pokemon side. And there's going to be another uh, giveaway announcement for the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! side of things. So uh, definitely check out both videos. And um, you know those will be posting here soon. So again, if you're subscribed, you'll know it's coming. You know. Like that. I'm really excited about that. I'm also excited for not just um, not just Astral Radiance, but from the Yu-Gi-Oh side of things, I'm also excited about um, Ghost from the Past 2, Dimension Force, uh, a lot of really exciting, it's going to be an exciting summer. Energy Retrieval, Heatmore, Ghastly, Slizipede, Yamper, this looks really familiar. <laughs> Open that one before. Alright, on to the next box. Next ETB, Darkness of Blaze. If I remember correctly, this is the one that has the Charizard. Um, troll me in the comments if I'm wrong, but I think there is a Char Charizard secret in Darkness of Blaze. Um, makes sense, you know. Um, anything that catches on fire is definitely a, a uh, what do you call it, a um, Charizard type thing. Um, believe it or not, Charizard is not my favorite uh, Pokemon. It's definitely one of the top ten. But uh, I'm a massive Mew fan. When I pulled the shiny Mew out of Celebrations, I'll link that video, I was just twisted on it. I, I couldn't believe it. And then, literal next, you know, Celebrations pack, the next pack after that, I pulled the, uh, the base set reprint Charizard. So I was very happy about that. One. Four. Ooh, that looks, that looks like we might have gotten something. One. Powerful. Colorless Energy, Tokapex, Toxapex, Galarian Mr. Mine, Aeron, Rookity, Wishy Washy, Pan Sage, Turbo Patch, and a Flygon Non Hollow. So, yeah, didn't get squat on that. Okay. Charizard artwork. If you see Charizard artwork, you know Charizard's going to attack. Um, uh, it's not opening at all, is it? So, um, as you can tell, I've been working on my display in the back. Kind of, uh, Adding to it slowly but surely, and um, trying to make it, you know, kind of balanced between the two TCGs I do right now. Now, of course, as more comes out, um, there's going to be, you know, more stuff that I open, more stuff that I review. Uh, there's going to be more Parasect, that's a good card, I like that. Big Parasol, Rowlet, Jigglypuff, Diglett, Panapur, Spinarak, Caterblast, and a Kangaskhan Hollow. I think I pulled that last time I opened one of these. So, not bad, not bad. 
So anyways, um, so yeah, I'm gonna have uh, other stuff. Uh, eventually it's gonna, it's gonna go further behind me and it's gonna have, you know, um, more figurines and everything like that in it. So, but at the moment it is what it is. Um, everything's a work in progress. The only thing that changes, the only thing that never changes is change itself. So you see right here, this line right here, that means we got something. So let's get to it. One, two, three, four. And water energy. Clang. Galtarita. Piers. Skarmory. Pansage. Electric. Fletchling. Torchic. Wiggly Tough. And Sizer V. That is a gorgeous card. It looks a little off center, so I'm not 100% on that, but it does look gorgeous. So, sorry, I'm looking down. I got my cats behind me. They're playing. They love being in the studio. All right. So far, I got. Let's see, that uh, other one was from the first set. So, so far, not bad. I don't know what the value is currently of these cards, um, but I will definitely be editing the values into it. I'm a collector, so knowing the value is uh, very big for me. Simply because of the fact that that's, you know, I'm collecting. Not so much to resell it, honestly, but I probably should put these up. Um, but I collect because I like the, the look of it, the, the shininess of it. So Pupitar, Fletchender, Hiding Darkness Energy, Carablast, Meltan. Starly, Aeron, Gubchu, and Spinarak, Reverse Hollow, and we got another hit. Oh my god, a Mew V. Oh, I told you guys, I love Mew. I pulled a Mew. I love Mew. I don't even know. That's definitely not a full art, but wow, that is a gorgeous, gorgeous card. That were that one. I was just gonna get. That would be my cell phone, which I don't even know where it is here in the studio, but let's uh, let's see what else we can get out of here. Let's see what else we can get out of here. All right, so we go to code card, and one, two, three, four, and we got Leaf Energy, Kabu, Simisage, Vanil Vanillish, Dunsparce, Clink, Marini, Torchic, Starly, Vanellux, again, it's, except it's not a hollow and a glaring Demeritone. I don't know how to say that. That's okay. Judgment-free zone here. Not all of us are perfect. We are perfect simply because we are imperfect. All right. So we got a Cup Chew. One, two, three, four. Let's bury the Cup Chew. We got a Lightning Energy. Powerful Colorless Energy. Sorry, Heat Fire Energy. Cub Chew, Wind Pod, Funnel Bee, Toxil, Sinistee, Sim Simipur, and Mel Metal. What is going on? Oh, my cats, uh, cats are getting into things. I might have to start making it to where they're not in the, uh, the studio anymore. <clears throat> Excuse me. Had to kind of chase them away. Not in any mean way, because, you know, love my cats. And they love me. My dog loves me too, but he gets into stuff just as well. So, stone energy. I think that's fighting energy. Yeah. Rose. Paltigeist. Soul Rock. Hippopotas. Golet. Skitty. Dino. Dino Jigglypuff again. God love Jigglypuff. Soul Rock is non hollow. And a sweet coon hollow rare. Not bad, not bad indeed. All right, so last pack of this elite trainer box. Then we won the brilliant stars. Uh, we only got a single pack. I went to Dollar General. I noticed so far, I was not going to Dollar General, you know, pick up basic stuff. I see that they always have like, um, I don't know if you guys saw it, but there was a little interruption. I had to go run and get uh, the wife a soda. So she's at work. No big. So. Here's what we got. Little PC, Duck Trio, Pokemon Breeders Nurturing, Ducklet, Marip, Paris, Gathira, Skarmory, Dedene, and Escalier. So, 
Let's open this up and see what we got in here. It's a single pack, so not really hoping for much. But I did get these are Dollar General, they're like five, almost six bucks. But you get this nice uh, Venusaur coin, biggest reason I got it. Um, an EV Cosmo Rare. And of course, a code card. So, single pack. What do we get? Let's find out together, shall we? Like I said, I've been seeing them. I've been kind of curious. You know, are they, you know, just like with everything else, is it worth it? You know, so, oops, I'm saying on code card. I seem to do that a lot with Burning Stars. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we got Water Energy, Probo Pass. This is our last pack magic, too. Team Yells Cheer, Cinchino, Clefairy, Cherubi, Corfish, Snow Runt. Uh, I just kind of jumped right to that. There's a clink. So an Eevee Trainer Gallery and a Hitran, Heatran, non hollow. All right. So. All in all, not too bad. I, we did get some pulls. We got the Mu V. We got an Eevee. We've got Sizer V. Uh, Indeedee. And a Sableye. All the, all the stuff will be posted. Um, like I said, I have a very big announcement coming. Uh, one I think everyone will be excited for. And uh, I can't wait to, for you guys to find out. So... Until next time.